Picture this, a bustling city where every street, every alleyway is humming with purpose. Each person in this city is driven by their own passions and ambitions, yet they're all interconnected, relying on the same infrastructure, the same resources to thrive. Now let's shift this image from the physical to the digital realm, where Bittensor is the city and Tao is the currency that keeps the lights on and the engines running. In this digital metropolis, subnets are like the diverse neighborhoods, each has its own flavor and specialty, akin to districts known for art, finance, or education. The folks in these neighborhoods, let's call them nodes, aren't flawless. They're learning on the job, making mistakes, but that's the beauty of it. They're growing, evolving, and in doing so, they make the city more vibrant, more resourceful. Tao is not just cash changing hands, it's the thank you to the baker for the bread, the nod to the street artist for the mural that brightens your day. It's the incentive that keeps the creativity flowing, the businesses booming, and the education flourishing. It's the reward for not only doing a task but for adding a bit of soul to the work at hand. In the grand scheme, Bittensor, with its Teo token, is like a grand experiment in communal living. It's not just a network, it's a society where every contribution is valued, every effort is incentivized, and where the collective goal is to not just survive, but to thrive and push the boundaries of what we once thought possible. So when I say Bittensore is about programmable, incentive configuration space, I mean it's about setting up a system where everyone, from the big thinkers to the doers, finds a place. It's a space where we encourage the dreamers to dream and the builders to build, and we all share in the spoils of our collective triumphs. And just like the real world, it's a bit messy, a bit unpredictable, but it's ours to shape and redefine as we learn and grow together.